Hey guys, I have a new book review for you. It is on Solstice, uh, the second book of the Devouring series, and this is by Simon Holt. And I'm deviating a little bit from Plan A. This book and Fearscape, which I also bought, wasn't initially going to be part of the books I would be buying or reviewing for the month of October. But after reading The Devouring, I just had to get the second and third books because I wanted to know more and I wanted to continue reading and that's the power of series. Once you buy one and once you're hooked, you have to keep going. And so I'm, I kept going and I finished Solstice in about a day, I believe, day and a half. So I just finished it this morning and it's time to do a review. Uh, so it's still fresh on my mind and we could talk about it. So let's talk about the synopsis very briefly. This will be very short because I don't want to give anything away from the last book or this book. This book takes place six months after the ending in the first book, The Devouring. Let's just say the Bowers have laid low for that time and they are brewing and they are planning and they are scheming for a big event and it has to do with Reggie. Reggie may be the key to bringing down all of humanity. That's all I'll say about that and I'll tell you that all the major players from the last book are in this book and some new characters are introduced in this book as well. Mysterious very mysterious characters, as well as an unexpected ally, which was very unexpected and surprisingly very awesome. We'll talk about the characters briefly. Uh, definitely check out the devouring review I did uh, yesterday, I believe. I talked about Reggie and Aaron and Henry. And there are some new characters introduced in this book as well. Very mysterious. I'll say they play on both sides of this war here that's going on. I also wanted to speak Unexpected Ally, which kind of threw me off and made the book really, really interesting. I wasn't expecting it. And as I was reading the book, it, it made the book very interesting and exciting and fun. So I was kind of a bit confused. I had mixed feelings about this person and I'll just say I really like this person and this person started to grow on me and I'm a bit confused because I don't believe I should like this person at all but I really do and this person made things very interesting and um, kind of fun. So that's all I'll say about the characters. Let's talk about the writing. The writing, like in The Devouring, the writing in here was very well done. Uh, it still reads like a movie playing in your head, which was awesome. The frequency of scary parts in this book didn't occur as much as in The Devouring, but when it did come up, um, it was still very disturbing and creepy. I will have to say it was a little bit cheesy um, in a part of the book. Not very long, but it was there. Um, but other than that, it was all good. The writing was awesome and it was continued to be a fast pace from beginning to end. The writing was awesome. It was great. Let's talk about the dialogue in this book because I did not speak about dialogue in the last review, but the dialogue in here was very funny, very sarcastic. We have um, the awesome, sassy, teenager commentary going on in this book, more so than in The Devouring, which made this book a bit more fun. The back and forth dialogue between Reggie and other characters in this book were really funny and really great. All in all, it was really good. The dialogue was really fun. So with that being said, Solstice by Simon Holt is definitely a readable in my opinion. Definitely check this series out. I highly recommend it. For those who are looking for a horror, scary series to get into, I definitely recommend it. There are some queasy, kind of disturbing imagery. I think that makes it more fun <laughs> and uh, more interesting. And uh, compared to other supernatural books where it's a lot of pretty sparkles and majestic creatures, this one goes into the gritty uh, dark side of it. The ending in this book, oh my gosh, it 
It was crazy, more so than in The Devouring. The cliffhanger in the ending of Solstice was... I'm speechless. I'm so glad I got Fear Escape to continue on to the, with the series and yeah. So uh, Solstice by Simon Holt. Definitely a readable. Check it out. Yeah, so that's my review. Hope you guys have a good day. I will talk to you guys later in this week and expect a review for Spear Escape. I'm very excited. And there's also going to be a bookshelf tour later this week as well. So um, I'll be busy with that and I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, bye.